Uh, if you are milling about, it's Sparks and Elgin today. Um, and if you're driving, try not to be distracted <laughs> by guys in their underwear. Uh, we've got Blake Bowgen, uh, he Bowgen here with us uh, from Morris. How are you? Very good, thank you. Yeah, How are you? I'm, I'm well, and we've got uh, the fourth year on the go here and a massive success. Last year was even bigger, right? Absolutely. Um, every year has been more successful than the year past, which is it's, it's getting harder and harder to top it. But we're, we're very proud of Ottawans and, and their charitable spirit, what yeah. they've been given. Yeah. This is an interesting... Uh, uh, you're not asking for someone to reach into their pocket. You're actually asking for the whole pant exactly. <laughs> and the jacket want, and everything. Yeah. Moore's uh, doing the Canadian uh, suit drive. Yes. And it is uh, something that is very important because you're talking about barriers to employment, right? Absolutely. Yeah. So um, last stat we have is unemployment's at 7.5% uh, right now. The majority of those being working age men. So, wow. um, you know, we're, we're trying to speak for an unspoken for demographic, which is, is working age men and trying to help them get back into the workforce. Mm -hmm. um, what we're working on specifically is um, job interview attire. So we're asking Canadians to give any gently used dress clothing that they're not wearing right now, uh, bring it into your local moors. We're going to give it to a local um, Ottawa charity to help gentlemen get back into the workforce. Yeah, and we've got to Alex and Frank here as an example, but don't exactly. come into moors with just the suit and then take it off and walk out. Yeah, you probably please. want a yeah, yeah. secondary plan there. <laughs> but, uh, you know, the only way you could get a real job uh, dressed in just your underwear is maybe a modeling job. Yeah. <laughs> Frank, uh, Frank and uh, Alex both agree, and you guys really have let yourself go. It's upsetting, I'm sure. <laughs> um, you've got some really cool partners along with you this time, uh, and some different ones too. Yeah, um, you know, uh, this year we're partnered with Ottawa Mission, YMCA, um, Brock Mission in Peterborough, um, so, so far reaching. Um, you know, last year we were with uh, the John Howard Society mm -hmm. and uh, we had a great partnership with them, but they just ran out of place to warehouse. Isn't clothing. that amazing? Yeah. That's such a good problem to have, really. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, it runs from uh, yesterday. Yeah. yeah, we were closed yesterday. To, so, yeah. so today till? Yeah. Uh, end of July. And right yep. to the end of July. Yep. So you've got a month to do this. Absolutely. It's actually really handy to purge out your closet too when it gets jammed up and these things that you just never wear anymore. Ab absolutely. And you're helping someone walk into a job interview and maybe nail that job interview and uh, and, and do well with life. A, a hand a hand up rather than a uh, you know hand out. Right? Absolutely. All we're all we're asking for is you know that clothing you have in your closet you're not wearing. Bring it in. It's going to really help someone out and get a new wardrobe at half price. That's the thing, if you're sick of, the, even if it's a suit you don't mind, you're just sick of wearing it, Morris has got a good selection. Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a good yeah. plan. Yeah. I like it. Uh, at, follow them on Twitter, at Morris Suit Drive. Check them out today at Sparks and Elgin, right? Absolutely, Sparks and Elgin, 11 o'clock. time, 11 o'clock. I'm sorry, guys, I couldn't make it warmer out there for you. But <laughs> you know what, uh, you'll have to use the signs creatively, yeah. I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Uh, all that information, a good idea. Just to take one of those suits that you're tired of and give it to somebody who needs it desperately. 